Good morning and happy Saturday. I didn't plan on starting vlogging this early, but look at this. <laughs> look at those little monkeys. <laughs> Alfie's covered in a blanket because he was all wet. Yeah, Alfie needs some clothes so he only has, he has a nappy. A bit of a nappy option. So, so now he is wrapped in a blanket in the meantime while he's drinking mm. his milk. Do you want to tell them what we're going to do? Yeah. We're going to Belfast. But what are we going to do in Belfast? We're going to a go to the shops. Go like the shops. The shop was like. I don't remember its name, but... Decathlon. Yeah. And it's basically a shop where there's a lot of stuff like outdoor and stuff. And, mm -hmm. and then we... And then... And like, a, then we'll go to Ikea for dinner and then we'll go back home. Yeah. But we, there's a trade off where we might actually go to Ikea for lunch instead. And what? come back home for dinner. We're about to leave and I just noticed something I didn't see this morning. Look, I have my first daffodil there. These are getting too old. My Valentine's flowers are going to have to go well. I might just, the roses are still holding and so are these. So I might just remove the gerberas, gerberas, I don't know how you call them in English. Um, and keep the rest. But this is so cool. I might buy myself a plant or two when we are in Ikea to just add to this shelf. But yeah, the roses are actually holding up really well. I really like that color. It's like not orange. It's like a corally color and they are very pretty. I really like them. Quite a lot of hours later, we are in the car, ready to go home. We had a really successful trip. We found quite a few things. I'm going to show you when we get home what we got. But um, we came to get mainly in you know, here stuff for the boys room including things to try and encourage Alfie to sleep more in his bed they both got a soft toy to go to sleep in Alfie what did you get? which teddy did you get? Uh, a cat a cat they both got a cat but they both got a cat yeah at first Alfie wanted a snake but then he, he changed his mind to a cat because he saw that I had the cat yeah Alfie always wants to copy one anyway one funny thing was that today well this weekend in Ikea is the sleep festival and we're kind of hoping that it will be a sign that now that they have some cool stuff to go in their room we got them like a little tent thing to go over their beds and yeah. certain small lights yeah see owen had his room we did owen's room up and owen is getting curtains and new bedding for his room and if he's not so to keep it fair we said that since we got some stuff for Owen, Alfie was getting the tent from us and if Owen wanted a tent too, he had to pay it with his pocket money so that's what he's doing um, and uh, yeah, we got a few things that I will show you later we had dinner there, which was just very predictable for an Ikea Standard dinner Ikea, Standard Ikea, but it was, it, was, it was nice and yeah, we are all, I mean this is James's face right now <laughs> this is Alfie's face Owen and I don't know if you can see but I'm really tired so we're going to drive home we'll have about like 45 minutes drive now to get back and hopefully well I don't know I'm kind of hoping he falls asleep but at the same time if he falls asleep now will he sleep tonight I don't know so we'll see what happens but one thing is for sure I think when we get home we'll all have a quiet time I think I'm going to put my pajamas on I still need to do my workout today I haven't done it but first I'm going to have a break because there's no way I can do my workout straight away. So I'm going to have some couch time first and maybe I'll do it tonight before bed. Like I've done the last few nights. Okay, we're back home so it's time to show you what we got. So I'm going to start with the decathlon where we went first. So we got the boys each um, water bottle. So obviously Alfie green and Owen blue. Then I am going somewhere in May which I will, I will explain more. Um, in detail at a later date but all you need to know for now is that it involves camping i need to have certain equipment uh, so i've been i'm just gathering stuff as i need to um my old trainers i can't remember if i showed you the soul is completely detached from the thing they are about 15 years old so it was about time i got new ones so i got these um ones i like colorful trainers and they were I can't remember the price, they no, were not that expensive, um, like in the 30 range, which is good. I got some pairs of socks, they are hiking socks because I'm going to need them uh, for later on. 
I got a helium camping pillow. What I'm going to do is involves camping, so I need to have some equipment for that. And then I need to have uh, things for heat, because they still have their winter stuff. That's why I wanted to go now, even if I won't need it until May. Because I need, uh, I wanted like a big chunky uh, fleece jacket. So I got this big really fluffy one. And I got just a plain black fleece jumper uh, to be able to like have layers on and all that. Owen needed a Scouts backpack, like so we got him this one, which is blue, so he's very happy. So that was the decathlon, and Ikea, so I have fabric to make some, we only have really old cushions on the in the living room, on the couch. Uh, so I have fabric to make cushion covers, so I just bought inserts and I'll make the covers myself in the fabrics I like. Then we got this game to play, which is like has like a target and it's like a velcro little things and there's numbers on the back we got a step because Alfie likes to help me with cooking and this one you can sort of have it cups and carry around the house toilet brushes for all the toilets in the house um, vases I broke two of my vases I'm using a jug uh, mostly uh, and I didn't have a smaller a shorter one and I didn't have one that goes out a lot but this one I'm absolutely in love with so new the, of these then they each got a tent we got one for Alfie and Owen bought himself one I'm going to install them and show you on their bed this is a balloon lamp for Alfie's room we got this Alfie likes to play with balls a lot but inside the house I don't want them to use any uh, hard ones so just to not damage anything so he has a small like a foam one and there's this one. I actually bought this for him before in Ikea. And I think uh, after Ikea, I went to pick up my pants at the airport. And I must have dropped it on the car park while I was filling the boot or something. Because it never made it home. And I have no idea where it went. But it was only £3, so it's okay. Then that's the bedding Owen had picked back in August for his bedroom. Just has loads of little triangles. The odd ones are slightly darker. This is the curtains for his room. So this is that uh, I have been procrastinating going to IKEA since before August. This is how bad I am. Um, so that's the curtains for his room as well. So I can finally eventually get his room finished. Then we got a um, lot of spare parts we were missing to build some furniture. And it's very good because you can get any of the one you're missing, but there were there are had some that were not in stock and I'm actually gonna ship them for free to our house. Then I got more of the scissors. I use these to cook a lot with. We have a pair of red ones, of old ones. Can't find them anywhere, so got more. Something I buy every single time. Brush, uh, dish, dish washing brushes. And then the bow, the boys both like, so they, we use those plates, the pack of three. Alfie always wants the green plate, Owen always wants the blue plate, so the orange gets used for other stuff. But we only have two of each that are getting old, so I got two more packets. So when they're being washed, there's no issue with arguing over plate colors. And I'm going to get rid, like we have some like older Ikea one. I had only kept the blue, but it's kind of, like I've been washed. That's a clean, you know, but there's like loads of, they're just not good anymore. So we are going to get rid of a lot of the plates and bowls. And also got a set of bowls uh, matching. Then I got a few of the bags. These ones are the big ones. I never use it usually. But I'm going to use that for my camping trip to pack stuff in my... I'm bringing a big hiking backpack with me. Uh, I'm going to wrap things in that just in case uh, I get caught in the rain to have stuff that's still dry. And these are for flights. They are the right size for um, you know, bringing toiletries and all-in-hand luggage. So I don't really use bags like this anymore because I don't want to throw them out too much. So I just keep them. I reuse them for different things and all that. And these, this is actually a display model. So they were happy to sell this. There are tiny little tin trays and they fit. I need to remove them. They are all attached by a little thing like this. But you can fit, I'm going to show you with one cup on so you can see the size better. This is one of the IKEA cups. You can fit that and then a few more things. So I very often eat my breakfast at my desk and I thought it would be handy to keep things clean uh, and they look very cute and pretty. So. This was an Ikea trip. This is what a little tent looks like. It's only a little, you know, goes over the head, but hopefully that'll be still enough. 
I need to stick his letters on properly. They still only have blue tag. The egg is downstairs. But I need to use some of the strips. I want to get those stickers off. They were from Owen's nursery before, because he was in his room before. And I never do, did anything about it. There's also a squirrel there. And I actually love that grain. So we're going to leave that grain. But I want to repaint the rest some color, probably. Maybe grey, because then it goes with the curtains and then have, you know, like colourful accents like red, orange. Sorry, it's blurry. It's very messy right now. <laughs> I need to tidy up. But this is basically his little bed now, so I'm going to call him and see what he thinks. Where's Alfie? <gasps> What's this? My tent! Is that your tent? Are you going to sleep there? Not now. Is that where Alfie's gonna go to sleep? In the yeah. tent? <gasps> You're very lucky. Can, do you want to try it? Mm -hmm. Go in your tent to see. Mm -hmm. Owen, uh -huh. We're gonna make a tent for Owen in Owen's bed too. You can put your biscuits down. Wow. Do you like to sleep here? Are you gonna sleep here in the night? Wow. Oh, Are you in a green tent? <laughs> Are you happy? <laughs> we'll make one for Owen in his bed too? Yeah. Do you like this tent? That's a big boy bed. No, you can't do that. Do you like it? Yeah. These are Owen's curtains, but the thing with IKEA curtains is that they are very long. <laughs> It's going to tie in everything together once we have all the pieces. This is the vision I had to start with, except that we never got around to do IKEA before and then it's going to have the green thing coming over. What we're going to do is that I'm going to cut the fabric to about here because we have a radiator over here and we don't want to cover it. So I'm going to make the same length as those old curtains. And then the rest of the fabric, I am going to make cushion covers with them. And it means that he can have cushions along the back of his bed. But when we start renovating his room, my mommy said that we could try making my bed to transform into like a couch, like you know, those, like one of those couch. Beds. Like it's called a day bed. So the idea is that I'm going to take some the rest of the material there. I'm going to get some big cushions, like three maybe. And we can have maybe four, we'll see, have them on the back of the wall during the day. So then he can just sit around like on the couch and he has matching this. I think it's going to tie everything in together. I also need to get the lampshade for that. This is an old one. But we're getting there, I think. And we need no, we're, that yeah. Yes, we need to fix a few things. So, but it's gonna come together. I'm gonna try. Now I can't. I can't do the cushions this weekend because I need to get more cushion covers, but uh, more cushions for inside. But I can probably shorten the curtains tomorrow. I'm not going to put the other one in yet. I'll just use the length of those to make them. So I'm going to put the uh, other one back on. Uh, when don't worry, I know what to do with that. So now we're going to sort out the bed. And there's the result for one. So you have to imagine that this will be up all the way. The curtains will be up here. This will be on. Hey, this is Owen's bed. You need to get off. Go and call Owen. Tell him to come up. Owen, it's that right? Yep. Yeah, I left the paint there because Alfie pulled this off and there's a bit of paint missing there. So I need to glue that back. Put a little hook back on. He has that blue light. And it's to go back up. Owen, it's a dad! Don't jump on the beds. I feel like Owen go in his bed. This is not your bed. Get out! Get out! Wait, I think he wants to lie down with you. Wait, go beside him to see. Here, but when you want to... Right, Alfie, nice Owen's turn, you need to get out. Owen can try it if you're in. Whoa, it's really good. Like it? Now look up, do you see why I was saying about the light? Mm, we can no. put it up there, but you won't see it. Sorry. Red light. Do you know what I mean? A red light. His star light was just there, but it, with that, it means red you can't see it. Light. Someone arranged, should we put it? A light. 
You might see the light coming through though, shining through. So we should not look kind of. Is that is that working the blue light at the moment? A light or light. Is it plugged in? We're gonna test it. We can test it before we put it on. Okay, right, go in, lay down. Okay, we're gonna see it. Okay, did you turn it on? Hold on. He turned it on, then he turned it off. Right. I so. can see this far. I can see. Is that good? Yes. Yeah. So there it was up there. This is there. This is Owen. <laughs> you like it? Yeah. I'm thinking of putting his red balloon light here so then he can turn it on and off and still see it from there. He has the moon over there. It was there for ages before we left it because he doesn't like to sleep fully in the dark so we leave that on in the night. Uh, but then means the red one would be here. Yeah, I just need to work things out. I'm kind of wanting to do something. His room is just not very practical at the moment. I need to declutter mm -hmm. it and then figure out which way. Maybe to change the layout of the room to... I don't... this one, I don't think... See if this big unit would fit over here in the recessed bit. That would be ideal. But I think it's too big. So for now it's going to have to stay here. I might try and move the bookcase though. In that gap here and move the table over here maybe or something like that this little table to be honest is not really using that much so I have to see if I'll keep it there or not but uh, for now he's not using it anyway so we'll see good evening it's actually Sunday now just wanted to quickly show you what I've achieved today um, I'm not there yet without his room a very awkward shape so I can't figure out exactly how to put the stuff around to make it work so it's probably gonna move around a little bit before we put stuff in temporary places in permanent places I mean but there's the tent we got him yesterday there's the red light it looks more orange there um, and then we've moved this bookshelf here it used to be here and made a more like homey corner there with this I need to change all the decor and stuff put this there for now he really liked that I need to sort through everything there there's a lot of toys I need to go but I wanted to have him to have more room to play with his cars so we've moved this over here I put a chair there I just need to sort through boxes and boxes of toys to get rid of what he doesn't play with this room so I've shortened and hemmed the curtains on both sides <coughs> I made his bed all nice, but he messed it up, and Echo keeps going in it. So there's that. I've put the light back on the wall after I blocked all the holes when I painted in the summer, and never put it back up. I have repainted the little bit there that was uh, missing paint. I'm waiting until tomorrow for it to dry fully before I put another hook to hook that up. And with the bits left from the curtains, I made four cushions, which are here. So they match that and he just says it's like a little couch over here. We used to have this little bit table in Alfie's room and we've removed it because it takes so much room. His room is not very big uh, so he never used it so we decided to just take it out for now. I might put it in Owen's room I will see or just donate it or sell it but it used to be behind his bed over here unless it fitted in that little space there I'm going to try that actually if it fitted there I could actually have that you have cars like and to park underneath and stuff on top you might like that but it seems a bit I don't know I'm going to try it now actually it doesn't fit um wondering about moving this maybe over there and have the table in the corner I'm not happy with that area basically I just feel I don't like that gap there I don't really like the way everything is there. It's just really hard to find a way to make everything fit. Oh, I just want to keep... I've tried so many different things and nothing really makes me happy about the way it looks. I'm almost tempted to move... Oh, no, I don't know. We've tried the bookcase here as well. It's just not working well. So this is probably the best place for the bookcase. And it's beside the bed and we use the books at bedtime, so... That makes sense. I'm going to try moving this over there and have the table here and see what it looks like. Right, this is not going to stay like this. It's just in the meantime, while I figure something out, I am just going to put this this way and the table there. Um, 
yeah I can't I can't work out a way unless I manage to move this back over there and have this table sticking up more I can't I can't if you can think of anything please let me know ideally I don't want to have to buy anything new it kind of plays see this to me if I was up to me I would actually remove the green table and put the white table instead but he's not going to be happy because he loves that green table um, but I might move it outside in the garden maybe as a temporary thing before it completely goes and yeah I'll see I think eventually something that might actually work better is to move one of the Kallax shelves that's two like four boxes over to that corner and instead of this one and selling this one or seeing if we can use it in a one's room for Playmobil storage because we have quite a few of those we have one of those that is over here at the moment which we could move but then I need to store stuff there or we could just get a new one they are 20 pounds so it's not that bad and we have them all around the house so we can switch the boxes around given he doesn't have any storage apart from this that might be a good idea actually I think I might do that actually next time just to have that whole whole wall as storage do away with the ta these two and have more storage down here eventually I want to do like Owen at the moment he has those boxes there uh, for, st for clothes and stuff but I want to do like Owen where I put doors on the part that is his wardrobe although for Owen what we have is that we have the clothes on one end and all the rest is toys with Alfie because I don't want him to mess around with the toys with the clothes I might leave all the top part um, with uh, that or even do like go up and down and leave like the three there with toys and I'll, I need to see I need to just sleep on it I think and that will be better I also have those lanterns that were for his uh, I think it was for his baby shower maybe I, can't, I think it was for his baby shower and then I took them from Teresa's house after she organized it and I'm thinking of hanging them somewhere else maybe all above here so that's another thing I need to do but yeah well for now anyway it's semi tidy and it's workable next step is going to be to divide this content not now tomorrow into smaller boxes so we can put all the stuff in the attic and I can declutter that space I need to get rid of that broken uh, gate there this is a picture of when as a baby dressed as a like it's like an artwork thing an artist in France does she takes a picture and she uh, adds stuff onto it so this is the, an actual picture of Owen that she's transformed it looks a bit creepy and kitsch but I think it's cool looking for the present I got from my sisters so that's going to go on the wall here once uh, everything there is decluttered so I have it there ready to go as soon as that's done